Okay guys, so I am going to show you all how to create an SVG in Illustrator. I'm just taking this random bare image from Canva. Sometimes they don't turn out correctly when you try to download them as an SVG. So I'm going to show you all how you can use Illustrator. So basically I'm just uploading the image into Illustrator. I'm going to file and then place. I will go ahead and find my image. Once I upload or place the image, I'm just gonna place it. And we're going to make it smaller just so we can work with it a little better in our workspace. And next I'm going to go up to image trace at the top and I'm always going to choose low fidelity. And it's just saying that this is a big image, so it may take a little while. Always choose low fidelity. It always just works the best for me, for the images that I choose to convert. So it did get rid of that one piece. So if you wanted that piece, all you have to do is go back and just choose another option other than low fidelity, play around with it until you include that piece. So now I just hit expand. And if you look to the layer side, you'll see all the different pieces. Now I want to just make me a copy. I just want the background piece. So I'm going to edit and copy. And then we're going to go ahead and go to properties over to the side. And we're going to unite everything. So we just want that back piece. And I'm going to change the color by copy in the color from the other image and next I'm going to group all of the other pieces that can be cut together or are the same color so I'm going to select one and then if you hit shift and then select the others you can select all of them and then you're going to go to object and compound path and make so it's just going to turn those pieces into one piece and we're going to bring it to the front and I hit object arrange and then bring to the front and next we're going to do the same thing with the black pieces we're going to go ahead and select and hit shift to select all compound and make that path and then you just arrange it how you need to arrange it and if you want the ears to be that darker brown, you can also do the same thing for those. So it's fairly easy. You just wanna put all the pieces together that you want to be together in the vector file and cut together like on your Cricut. And now if I go look over to the layer side, you can see all of the pieces. So if you get like a random piece you don't want there, you can easily select it and delete it so this is just a simple image but you can do this with most images without complication so next i'm just going to export it and we want to export it as an svg and so you just name it and then if you go if you look down and you see format you do have the option to change the file type but it was already on svg and so then we'll just export it and hit OK. Now I'm going to go to Cricut and this is how I check to make sure my SVG looks appropriate and there are no random pieces. And so once we upload it, you'll see that it looks perfectly fine. You'll look at all of the different pieces and those will cut together. So if you all have any further questions, it's so easy. Just leave them down in the comment section below.